Check out this week's build showcase of Ringwood Fire Department Stonetown Fire Company's new Dodge Durango. Features sound off signals, blueprint electrical system. We got an Enforce NXT light bar. We've got the Weston Elite push bumper with four M powers in the front, M powers on each side. Down the side, we've got M powers under the mirror, M powers in the rear side window. And then in the back, we've got an interior Enforce light bar. We're flashing the parking lights via the blueprint control system. We've upgraded their reverse lights to LED, and we've got M powers on the rear lower bumper. With the hatch up, we have the replacement floor mounting system with the electronics underneath it. They don't have any necessarily radios in the back, but they do have remote mic kits. So they've got the mics on the side with the mag mics, and then they have the scene function between the two toggles, which brings you up, to up top, which has the observe lights from sound off signal in a red-white combination. And then we have the speakers for those rear radios mounted in the back. So with the green command button on, You've got green on the rear mirrors, the rear side glass, and the rest of the light bar lights are doing a aura pattern. Checking out the front console, we've got a sound off dome light. Troy console with their two radios, the blooper controller, cup holders, and then a padded armrest. With the vehicle and drive response mode, you can see that we have our pattern change along with our DRLs flashing. And then we have the M powers down in the fog that we missed before. And then you can see the rest of the pattern has white and a more aggressive pattern for response. That changes automatically when you put the vehicle in the park. You have the OBD2 link. That's part of the control system and changes everything automatically for you. If you have any questions about this build or one built better to suit your needs, please feel free to reach out to us. We'd love to help you out with your next project.